All right, so I took one of Jamie's smaller brain strains and this is it. And this one also has oil, capsaicin oil everywhere that you see the shiny bit, or the shiny bit in the placenta. Now, unfortunately, the seeds in this one were bad, so I've had to take those out. But if you have a look inside, I would say this one has more oil than the yellow primo did. Shiny, shiny at the bottom there, at the bottom of the, the wall there. That's the capsaicin oil that goes all the way down to the bottom, you see on both sides. And the contorted growth that these things have. Nice brain strain. And I guess I'm going to be crazy enough to eat that because I want to compare how hot one of these brain strains is to uh, to the yellow primo and if I eat one now I've got a better chance of comparing the two at least that's the uh, tortured thinking um, after the first two maybe thinking isn't quite the right uh, adjective but anyway we'll try that one next Oh, I'm actually still sweating from that Primo, but uh, oh, that was a good five minutes ago when I ate that one. Um, so, this, this one I've just shown you, covered in oil, is a brain strain. And I need to psych myself up a little bit for this one. <laughs> How long do I want to spend crying like a baby on the ground this afternoon. Well, the flavor's entirely different. More of a hint of sweetness to that. <coughs> God, that was warm. <coughs> so this one, as before, this one goes straight to the back of your throat. So unlike the Yellow Primo, which didn't hit the back of my throat at all, it was all, all tongue burn. You can hear how my voice is going a little bit. This one, by, oh God, bypasses all of your tongue, bypasses most of your mouth. I've still got bits up front, but they're not doing much. Oh, they've heard I was doing chili reviews. It's <coughs> probably the ambulance. <coughs> oh boy. Now, it's a completely different burn. Totally different. It's all at the back of my throat. It really, it really is that hot coal. And it's very, very hot in the back of my throat. My tongue, the back of my tongue is starting to burn a bit, but only around the sides and slightly underneath. Much like the first time I did that one. How hot is it? Well, it's a lot hotter than the Yellow Primo. Oh, yeah, that's a lot hotter. <clears throat> oh. oh, I'm kind of regretting that now. Oh, that's hot. Yeah, definitely a great deal hotter than the Yellow Primo. Um, starting to get an endorphin rush now. I feel lightheaded. My mouth really hurts, or rather, my tongue and the back of my throat really hurt. Oh. <sighs> yeah, that's that's ridiculously hot. I've got really hot tears as well now, my eyes are really smarting. Huh. 
pull those things out. <sighs> Finding it difficult to talk right now. Oh. Still building. Back of the tongue, back of the throat. Absolutely just caning, caning. Oh. really stinging as well. I haven't touched my face. Oh, those are hot. That's uh, that's the hottest, uh, the hottest of the chilies that I've had. I just have to wait for it to go down now. Oh, oh God. Still on the way up. I'm actually starting to get some burn on my lips now. Not my tongue, but my lips themselves. tingling in my hands like last time my legs huge amounts of tingling in my feet very very light-headed ah, that's a yeah that's the endorphin rush same as last time oh god yeah huge huge endorphin rush again what not just don't know what to do with myself I don't know where it's, there's nowhere comfortable there's nowhere to go and nowhere to hide <laughs> oh god I'm shaking oh. it's almost like you get the chills it's the, the they're so intense God, I'm dizzy. Uh, let's really try not to swear. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, just the same as before. Ridiculous heat. Ridiculous. Back of the throat, back of the tongue, and massive endorphin rush. Oh, God. If somebody told me I was 10 feet off the floor right now, I would believe him. Yeah, I'm, we're back to rocking back and forth. I'm sure I'll be in the fetal position any time. <laughs> oh, I'm absolutely dripping. It's raining, raining from my eyes, raining from my pores. My arms are sweating, my legs. And the heat's peaked, just. Uh, but the endorphin rush hasn't, and that's now that's now taking over from the heat. Um, I would guess that the endorphin rush is what's causing the heat to dissipate. God, it's just so shaky. It's just involuntary. You, you can't help it shaking my, my feet and my legs um, oh. so there you have it brain strains are hotter than yellow primos teppings I would say they're hotter than everything I haven't tried the reaper yet um, I do have one 
and I'll be trying that maybe the day after tomorrow. I'm really going to have to stop doing this. <laughs> of course I'm not, but holy crap. Oh. So the heat's very much on the way down. Um, it's dissipating fairly quickly. The back of my tongue, or it's, it's the sides and, and underneath my tongue more than the back and my throat. <clears> that <throat> really, really hurt. Um, it is, it's definitely on its way down, uh, no question that's true. Um, my endorphin rush is no, is nowhere near going down. It's, I'm still here, I'm still shaky as hell, very lightheaded. Oh the other things you do. I've still got hot tears. Uh, definitely going away. The heat's definitely on the way down. Uh, I'm still very shaky. But uh, not quite as bad as five minutes ago. Oh, I really don't know what to say. Um, I'd love to be able to entertain you with all sorts of stories, but I just can't. <laughs> this is just, oh, crazy stuff. All right, so I'm not quite sure where we are with time. 10, 12 minutes maybe, and now the heat's, the heat's just down to a mellow warmth all over, um, but all over means my entire body. Uh, I'm shaky pretty much everywhere, um, but that's coming down as well, endorphin rush is only going to last a few, five minutes maybe, but I'm definitely on the way down with that too. And we'll see about uh, we'll see about any other effects. Um, see if I get any cramps or not this time. Um, I did prepare by eating breakfast, and I had a bunch of peanut butter before I ate uh, the teppings. Um, and we'll see what that does. If I was going to get cramps, it would definitely be this afternoon. So. Uh, we'll see what, what comes out and uh, I'll write in the notes whether I got cramps, but oh, this is Nigel Carter who's been beaten to a pulp and into submission by a fairly small brain strain. <coughs> so, uh, it's goodbye from him and it's goodbye from me. Goodbye and let's hope I survive this afternoon. Thanks for watching this pain and I'll see you again soon. Oh. Oh. That was just the endorphins to get rid of. See you later.